It says 1.7 deals with the Apollinus theorem. Suppose there is any triangle ABC and if AD is the median on BC. So it means that D is the midpoint of BC. In other words, BD is equal to DC. Then we apply the Apollinus theorem. It states that AB square is equal to AC square. Sorry, AB square plus AC square is equal to 2AD square plus 2BD square. So it's something like this. AB square plus AC square is equal to 2AD square or 2 times the median square plus 2BD square where BD is half of BC so 2 times BD square so instead of writing 2BD square we can also write 2DC square because BD and DC are equal so we use any one half of that side not both the, both the sides okay. so it's AB square plus AC square is equal to 2 times the median square so 2AD square plus 2 times any one half square, so 2 bd square. We use this Apollinus theorem when the median of a triangle is given, or we can prove it. If we can prove it out, we can use Apollinus theorem. It's important that the median of the triangle is mentioned. Also, we can use it when midpoints are mentioned, when the diagonals of parallelogram are given, or proved, or asked. So we solve this exercise 1.7 with Apollinus theorem to get the desired answers. For example, suppose ABCD is a parallelogram and the adjacent sides are given to be 11 and 17. And one of the diagonals, let's say BD, is given to be 26. So we use the property of the parallelogram and that is the diagonals AC and BD, they bisect each other, which means that point M is the midpoint of both the diagonals. So if BD is 26, we can say that DM is half of 26, which is 13, and BM is also half of 26, which is 13. Now we are asked to find the other diagonal. So we need to find how much is AC. Now if you concentrate, if you look at this carefully, you can say that this particular triangle ABC, this particular triangle, we can say that this BM is the median on side AC. That's because M is the midpoint. So we can apply the Apollinus theorem in this triangle and the formula would be AB square plus BC square is equal to 2 times the median square, so it is 2 into BM square plus 2 times any one half square, so we can write AM square, 2 times AM square. So let us substitute AB square 17 square bc square is 11 square is equal to 2 times 13 square plus 2 times am square. So 17 square is 289 plus 121 is equal to 2 into 169 plus 2 am square. If we solve this further, it would be 9 plus 1 is 10, 1 carry. 8, 9, 10, 11, 1 carry, 2, 3, 4, 410 is equal to 2 times 169 plus 2 times AM square. Then if we write, if we divide 2 on both sides, we shall get 205 is equal to this 2 gets cancelled, so we have 169 plus am square. So that is 205 minus 169 is equal to 
am squared. So if it's a practice, we shall get 46 is equal to am squared. So am is equal to square root of 46, which is equal to 6. So we get am as 6. So if am is 6, mc is also 6 because m is the midpoint. So the length of this diagonal AC would be equal to 2 times the length of AM, which is 2 into 6, which is equal to 12. So you saw that we use the Apollonius theorem, the formula for the Apollonius property, and we could solve for the diagonal of the parallel graph. Solve the sums to get more confidence. Thank you.